Hello and welcome to Hookball final gameplay video. And why do I say final? Because the game's nearly done. Yay! It's got everything it wanted. It's got uh, weird enemies, cool bosses, cool graphics, excellent music, and um, and yeah. So I just want to show you how the game is looking right now. Um, I'm, I'm going to be playing uh, with a mouse. The game is designed uh, from the ground up for uh, iPads, but uh, for the sake of convenience for the capturing, I'm just going to be playing on on my PC. So. Uh, let me just show you first how, how the game works. Um, in hook bold you can't uh, move around freely. What you do is you, you click on the enemies, or rather you tap on the enemies to move around. So um, That's how you move. Um, you flick enemies to punch them. So uh, uh, if depending on in which direction you flick, you, you flick, you know, you punch the enemy in that direction. Um, Oh yeah, got it. You punch enemies in the face by flicking them. Yeah, and so you also punch by tapping on empty space. If you tap on empty space near an enemy, you you capture it. I guess. And what happens with the captured enemies? You basically uh, just keep them, and when you when you when you flick the next one, you shoot all of them out at once. That's quite handy. So this glowing thing in the background, it's like a stopwatch. It's actually supposed to be like a Mayan calendar stone thing, but it's actually just a stopwatch for the sake of convenience. Um, when the time runs out, you die. And uh, that's how the game works. Uh, the, 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 time, the time is ticking down all the time, and there's no energy bar in the game, so you have to keep close attention to the, to the time. When you, when you get hit by enemies, or you drop off the bottom edge of the screen, uh, you lose time. So uh, if you've got plenty of time left and you get hit by an enemy, you'll survive. But if you've only got like a little bit of time left, because when you get hit, you actually lose some time. If you lose too much, then you die. So it's, it's actually really important to keep a good eye on the on on the stopwatch and uh, try to keep it filled up with time as, as much as possible. Um, in the game, you you increase the time left by picking up the gears that uh, the enemies drop when you kill them. So this this bronze things, the, the, the bronze gears. And when you when you pick them up, they add like a tiny bit of time. You see that I'm also uh, uh, picking up some golden gears. These are uh, disappear when you when you bang an enemy into another enemy. So when when you knock an enemy by by throwing another enemy into it, like this, you get up the, the golden coin. And then you pick up the coins simply by by uh, swiping your finger across them, as you can see. So that's basically the game. I, uh, so now the tutorial is finished, and I'm playing the real the, the real game. Um, I'm gonna be playing and talking at the same time, which is maybe not the best idea, but uh, um, the game is quite demanding in that way. So. I'm, I'm going to be trying to show you the, the interesting bits of the game and show you uh, the crazy enemies and all this. So you see that there's there's, there's quite a few enemies. Um, I've tried to keep them as various varied as possible. Um, oh shit! I got hit by a bullet and then I died. So there you go. Uh, okay, I'm gonna. It's quite a hard game, as I was saying, so I'm going to be trying to show you uh, as much as I can, but uh, I'm, I don't think I'm going to be able to show you like the, the whole the whole game, but hopefully um, the most uh, interesting bits, maybe, hopefully. I don't know. The game is randomized. It's got randomized enemies and randomized uh, stages, so um, I can't guarantee that, you know, I'm going to be watching whatever I want, but rather what the, the game decides. So there's the first miniboss. Um, it's got some protective shields which you have to knock off by throwing enemies into them. And then, yeah. And then the laser ones are really quite annoying because the, the laser shoots out in different directions and you don't really know. Um, you have to watch carefully in order to know. Where the, enemy, where the laser is 
not going to be shooting towards, so... So I have to keep, eye, keep an eye on my on my time. You can see it's, it's already warning me, but but fortunately I managed to. The thing is, when there's not many enemies on the screen, you, you have to be really careful. And oh shit, I got hit. Okay, one more go. Let me just try and throw a bomb into this guy. Oh no, I missed. So, because you've got to keep an eye on, on the time, even when you're um, fighting a mini boss, you still have to, um, you know, make, make sure that you have plenty of time so you can't really concentrate on, on just. Oh, okay. Yeah, there you go. I'm giving you a lesson on how to play the game and instantly get killed. So you see some some jellyfish appear in the bottom. Uh, these are oh yeah, and I got this one as well. Okay, I'm trying to kill it with them. Oh, oh yeah, I killed it. So the jellyfish are, are bouncy, so you can't you, you can if you try and kill them, they you know you can't they, you just bounce off them and. Um, they also split into more uh, jellyfish, so they, if you don't kill them off early, they, they tend to in invade like half the screen, which is really annoying when you're trying to fight an enemy and then you, you have these jellyfish which are, you know, in invading your screen and making you bounce, you know, sort of weird directions. So these mosquitoes drop uh, golden coins when you kill them. Which is oh yeah, and, and, and that enemy decided to drop a shower of golden coins for some reason. They do that sometimes. Uh, I think it's actually quite interesting that the enemies sometimes randomly help you as opposed to trying to kill, kill you. Yeah, got killed. So, but but you got to see one of the one of the mini bosses, which is these these worms. Um, they're, they're quite funny, I think. Let me just try and play the game once more. The last time. Oh yeah, you have this guy again. I'm just trying to kill him off. Oh, no, okay. That was too fast. One more. Second mini boss, which is quite fun, I think. Nearly. These, these purple ones are quite annoying. They look like beetles and they're really quite annoying. Oh, yeah, and here he comes. Um, so, this mini boss uh, shoots a big laser towards you, and you have to um, hide behind these mine stones so I'm hiding behind it I'm going to try and hit it now and now he switches places so I have to hide again oh yeah but then this people appear which tries to bounce bounce off me all the time so I'm running out of time I die. So you can see that the game is actually pretty intense, um, but I think it's a lot of fun. So um, uh, thanks for watching. I'm just going to leave it here for now. Uh, thank you very much and take care.